Imagine being offered hundreds of millions of dollars for something you've spent 50 years developing. It had obviously set you up for life. But the man behind a miracle cure made out of pawpaw cream won't sell. It cures everything from eczema to migraines, arthritis to severe burns. But Tom MacArthur wants to make sure everybody can get it. And that's why he's knocked back the world's biggest drug company, fearing they'll buy his product and bury it to protect their own. Tim Noonan has more. How many people have you saved? Thousands. Literally thousands now. And talk to the thousands of people he's helped, oh. and they'll tell you he's a saint. You trust him with your life? I'd be in hospital now with my foot cut off, really, and I can't thank you enough. <laughs> Thanks, Tom. He has found the answer. From life-threatening wounds to cosmetic conditions, severe burns to cellulite, skin cancer to eczema, migraines, even gangrene. Chronic wounds, aches and pains, arthritis. All cured with a completely natural cream made from pawpaw. It's a miracle cream. This product has now moved on to scientific development and uh, uh, it hasn't come from a, a large industrial laboratory. It's come from a backyard laboratory that uh, has been uh, uh, developed by this inventor. How much faith do you have in your product? Enough faith to put my fingers in boiling water. Ah! Cut myself. Uh, chemically burn myself. I've tried it all. It takes about four to five seconds and the pain just dissipates. Six months ago we brought you the remarkable story of Tom MacArthur. Liquid gold mate. The backyard inventor who's knocked back a fortune from the world's biggest pharmaceutical companies. What were you offered? I won't tell you Tim because it's uh, the figures staggering. So you've been offered millions? Yes. And you knocked it back, why? because they'd probably shelve it. Since our story, Tom has been swamped. Tens of thousands of letters, desperate pleas for help. And a lot of them are in so much pain. He's found the answer for my pain in my fingers with my arthritis. Del Jensen has osteoarthritis. That's as far as I can pull them there. Honest truth, you can't honest, pull your fist honest, Not without too much pain, and it is too painful. Anybody with arthritis knows just how debilitating that pain is. But Del never expected this. I rub him in and I rub it on. That's all I do. Within minutes, she can make a fist. Look. You've already made a fist and so many people. I'm already minutes. making a fist. Still working on my thumb. I do not have a pain in my fingers. I swear to you, I do not have a pain in my fingers. Wow. Well. Look at that. He's not offering me false hope. He's not offering me quackery. He's just offered me some cream to try. I tried it. I don't have pain. Hello, Tom. Hello, Katrina. Paraplegic Katrina Ford suffers from chronic wounds. Oh, it's so good to see you. One minute you've got a little spot on the bottom of your foot and the next minute they can tell you they've got to cut your foot off. When a year-long ulcer refused to heal, doctors decided amputation was the only answer. There we are. Thank you. And Tom stepped in. Within a week yeah. of using the cream, it was easily 50% better. Within yeah. two weeks, 75% better. It was remarkable. Yeah. And it's blown me away how, yeah. how good the cream is. Hello, Margaret. Hello, Tom. Wonderful to see you. Good to see you. Before Tom came along, Margaret Lidford suffered unbearable chronic pain in her legs for 30 years. How long have you been suffering? All that time, really. Yes, it aches and I go to sleep every night and I wake up every hour with the pain in it. A week ago, they were very red and very coloured. There we are, love. Thank you. No medication worked until Margaret tried Tom's cream. And the pain went? And the pain went, yes. So what do you see him as? Miracle worker. <laughs> she used it for just seven days. Yes, it's gorgeous actually, yes, to be able to know that I'm going to walk properly again. It's now medically proven that it encourages uh, the blood flow. If you get more blood there, then obviously the immune system works. How, how do you think it works? Well, 
really and truly, I think it's magic. <laughs> The story of Tom MacArthur is really starting to stack up. While there's plenty of anecdotal evidence, so far medicine hasn't caught up with Tom's cures. Only time will tell if his treatments will pass scientific scrutiny. Certainly the cases that I've seen seem to show a significant improvement on this treatment where other treatments have failed. The uh, area here has uh, been less painful since we've started the treatment. Professor Michael Woodward is a clinician and researcher for Melbourne University and Austin Health. All sorts of treatments can achieve healing, but this seemed to be consistently achieving healing in patients. And it was really very surprising, uh, and it was certainly something I saw with my own eyes. I was very, very impressed. At the Heidelberg Hospital in Melbourne, he's conducting a rigorous clinical trial into Tom's prototype formula, Opal A. I point out it's not Paul Paul uh, itself, it's a modified version, but it uh, is going to be attractive if it works because of its natural origin. In 2003, Opal A was filed to be patented worldwide by a private company. Nice. Almost a decade down the track, it's still tied up in red tape. Most drugs take about 10 years from the time that they're first manufactured in a test tube to the time that they're being used uh, in uh, people uh, and uh, that's not an unusual time course. We'd like it to be shorter but uh, science has to be done precisely, thoroughly, methodically. So while Opal A gathered dust, Tom went back to the drawing board. After years of trial and error, it was his wife, Linda, that discovered a new formula. Tom believes it's more powerful than ever before. It even works on burns. Maestro. I'm about to deliberately burn myself in boiling oil. Which finger don't I need the most? Just be careful. It's 175 degrees. Definitely don't try this at home. Oh! Just a dip, but it really hurts. It's definitely burning. I'm dipping. But I can honestly say, several seconds later, the pain disappeared. I yeah. think the, the pain's gone, actually. Yeah. <sighs> Even the sound recorders decides to test the waters. How's it feeling, Greg? That's really, really hot and painful. <laughs> <laughs> so that's gone, the pain's gone. A little tingle, but not too bad, no. This is quite unbelievable. So the three of us have just burnt our fingers in 175 degree oil. And, um, and the three of us have fingers that are absolutely fine. Just think of what this poor, poor formula could do for sunburn. The hard bit's been knowing that we could have got it out there much earlier. And we didn't. That was a hard bit. Tragically, Linda never lived to see their lotion hit the shelves. She passed away late last year. You made a promise. I made a promise. To your wife? Mm hmm What was that promise? I had to get the lotion out there. And help people. And you're going to do it? Yep. What happened next left Tom in tears. For the first time, someone decided to help him. An investor saw his potential, bought him a pawpaw farm. Your dream's coming true, buddy. Wait till you see it side. It's unbelievable. <laughs> and a brand new factory to begin producing Linda's formula. So this is the nerve centre. This is the nerve centre. So these are your babies. These are the babies. <laughs> We've got to keep them cool. One man against the pharmaceutical companies. I'll tell you what, it's a far cry from your kitchen. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or so he thought. A small army soon arrived of a different kind. You ready? Coming down. I told you it was two coming down. That's it. Grab it, Harry. Yeah! Drop it. I'll catch it. Well done, mate. Well, that's a good lot. That should make some really good medicine, shouldn't it? Friends and family, people he'd helped, 
rolling up their sleeves for free. A lot of the people that we've helped with their ailments now want to come up here and help us. And you think you'll be able to produce enough here to supply Australia? We will. Yeah, we have the facility now. There's nothing holding us back. So how do you feel? Oh, well, the moon. I just can't believe it. Every drop counts, eh? Every drop. And it'll help so many people. He cares. And I know it's not for money. I know it's not for money. Um, he would accept nothing from me at all. He just wanted to fix my hand. You've made a difference to my life. He's so genuine. And so loving, actually. <laughs> and he's trying to help so many people. That's it. And he's going to help a lot of people. Words of thanks are all they have. They'll believe. We will. Bye bye, Tom. But it's all Tom MacArthur wants. Problem. Thank you very much. Well, I've just had enough. I've had enough of waiting. I made a promise to my wife that I'd get out there. And we will. That is some kind of story. That was Tim Noonan reporting, and all of the details on how to get in touch with Tom MacArthur will be on our website, yahoo7.com.au slash today.